uh, we talked about that you know this, uh, after the film cut uh, it's not bad it's sometimes you know uh, I talk about my favorite films uh, not just my favorite films you know so many people favorite films in including me or the films you know there's a uh, it's a great film like uh, uh, Eight and a Half Fellini actually uh, one of the my best 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 you know influence film in my life and uh, uh, so many people go crazy about this film um, I am too uh, uh, the reason you know uh, I'm starting to talk about the films I wanted you know there's a new generation people or new cinephile you know you know a, get into these films and watch it and learn from it and be better uh, viewer and or or filmmaker you know uh, uh, be more you know the uh, refresh uh, himself uh, as a filmmaker uh, how did they do it before uh, because so many things you know today is happening in cinema if you watch the old film then you know oh my god this is not new at all you know the people did it amazing way for example 20 years ago 30 years ago even 50 years ago one of the films you know this eight and a half eight and a half you know there's a most interesting film about cinema no doubt about it uh, about cinema about the one filmmaker which is you know you can watch it and you know it and it came from the one filmmaker you know that's a, uh, one of the most interesting and influential filmmaker in the whole entire you know history of the cinema the Fellini uh, the, few different things in this film is very amazing. First of all, I think for me, you know, three or four, you know, black and white movie in cinema is stay forever. You know, let's say one of them, uh, Griff of Rats, you know, John Ford, and Greg Toland did it. I think uh, the second one, definitely this one, and uh, uh, which is Johnny DeVranzo did it. Johnny DeVranzo, uh, the cameraman from, uh, he worked with Antonioni, worked with Fellini a couple of times. And this film, black and white, is amazing uh, 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 imagination uh, about the, you know, the uh, pacing uh, from the white to gray, from gray to black, from black to white. And, you know, the, so many different layers in the black and white. You can feel it. Probably if the film be color, you never feel that. or never see that. Imagination in this film about the dream, about reality, about past, about women. Mostly, there's an interesting about uh, collection of the women from the one filmmaker life. You know, there's a uh, as a mother, as a lover, as a wife, as a kid, as a this, as a sister, as a as so many, so many, and, and the, the, the woman from his dreams. And so many different uh, 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 quality and culture about the, how much the director know about life. Always remind me this this Homer story, you know that like you know there's a, a Odyssey, Odyssey about cinema, Odyssey about your 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 mind, as you know how you can you know you know uh, uh, walk in your mind and you know there's a find the things you know you believe and find the things you know you know about life or you dream about life or you experience it about life and then you have a chance as a one filmmaker or you have a good medium like that and you can experiment experience it that one uh, your experience and uh, then show it and share it with the audience uh, Fellini I think as you know that in the 42 years old 43 years old at that time we make this film he's in the best uh, uh, time of the, his shape as a year as a, uh, as a energy and as a everything film has uh, the moment the film came to world uh, almost you know like uh, not so many times, you know, in the cinema, the things like that happen. I think, I think, for example, you know, the, the Griffiths movie, Anthony uh, uh, Lawrence, or 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 uh, uh, Native of Nation, or this or that, uh, that kind of film from Griffiths, you know, that uh, moved the cinema to future. And after that, I think is you know, there's a, uh, for example, you know. Uh, Orson Welles movie, The Citizen Kane, that that kind of influence and it's coming and you know sh shake the history of the cinema. And after that, I think it's you know Breathless is coming uh, from the Godard, and of course between there's so many great films coming. But the moment is you know, uh, or or La Ventura from Antonioni is coming to that way, or or you know there's a uh, uh, good someone Gotari from the Musugushi son is coming that way, and I think it's you know uh, Tony Blood is coming that way from the Kurosawa son and a couple of films from uzo -san also. But this film is coming and changed the cinema, changed the whole history of the cinema at that time. If you watch it now, it seems like, you know, yesterday I finished this film. And so many things fresh forever. The way the technique, the way they, the, 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 
it, it seems like you know there's a, a somebody know about everything about life and art about architect about music about this about uh, you know there's a painting about uh, you know there's a, a culture about so many the, the, uh, uh, material you can find as a how uh, one filmmaker like Fellini know about the, these things and how you can bring it for you and express it with you uh, and how can bring it you know there's a uh, uh, share it with you film is very uh, so many characters it's gallery it, like you know, I think more than 100 characters probably uh, and the, all of them you know there's a came from that somebody's dream you know there's a uh, uh, actually this Fellini's dream as a uh, his life and his experience and life in the past as a childhood and everything uh, uh, and stay fresh and original and original and original please watch it watch it and experience it because these days actually in the, uh, the different cinema I see the flyer from this film you know supposed to come into cinema uh, in Tokyo please go to watch this film because you experience something you never experienced it before and bring your knowledge and your feeling and your manner and everything about the cinema so up and you know they make you so stingy to see the other films and I, I believe you know there's a some kind of film like eight and a half give the chance to you to 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 your your personality is getting raised and more you know there's a get grow up about the art and about life and mostly about cinema. It and have one of the most interesting films in cinema exists forever. Thank you very much, Kurt.